I plan on living a very, very long time. Right. That's a thousand years. At least. That's yeah. like, yeah, but, um, do you think we'll, uh, uh, perhaps a better question. Do you think you and I will, will experience the benefits of technological advances that will enable us to live beyond one or 200 years? I will. What about me, man? I'm, <laughs> I'm like, only a few years younger than you. Shit. I don't know. Like, Come on, dude. Let's uh, look yeah, well, I think, I think, I think a, big, a big part of it is like um, how open are you to emerging technology? So, you know, um, I'm, I also have a greater chance of dying beforehand from being a beta tester for yeah. a lot of these things. But I'm like, you know, I reckon I'm probably getting close to being on the cusp of living forever. Hmm. You know, it's going to happen in the next hundred years. Yeah. But you know, some people are going to have access to that technology before others. Yeah. Some people are going to be willing to risk that early enough yep. that it delivers benefits that gives them escape velocity. Mm. So I've, I just checked since, since I was in high school in 1999, when the death calculator came online, it said I was going to die in 2052. My mate for my birthday, thank you, Haig, um, send it to me and it's actually uh, 2065 now. Oh. So, in just over 15 years, it's increased by 13 years. Wow. So, we're almost at escape velocity, right? Mm-hmm. You, when you read things like this, you realize it. So, I'm very confident that, that I will have access to it. A big part of that is I would be amongst the first people in Australia to engage with this. And if it was life extension technology, I'd do it whether it was legal or not. Wow. Because I've read the legislation and most life extension technologies are talking, you know, between 16 and 26% extension of life and the maximum jail terms are only six years. <laughs> so you actually get, you, you get, you get a net benefit. Oh, and if you, if you just smash all of them at once, right, <laughs> stick them all on one plasma, then it's only you only get charged <laughs> once. <laughs> oh, that's so crazy. But, but, but you know, I'm doing this cost benefit analysis all the time and that's why I'm like yeah. I'm living till a thousand baby like yeah. you know and not everyone is going to say I'm going to go to jail for six years because yeah. they might be the best six years of my life or something Yeah, I'm going to like you know just fucking bend over take like a man and <laughs> get out of there as quick as I can <laughs> get on parole as quick as quick as, as possible Thanks for listening to Blab Coats. Rate and review our podcast on iTunes or wherever you get your podcasts because it does help us spread the word. And if you like what we're doing here, then help us grow it by sharing this with a friend, a friend of a friend, or your mailman, even your mailman's mailman. We also want to hear from you, so send us questions or comments to blabcoats at gmail.com. And if you have any interesting questions or comments, then we'll talk about it on air.